Hey y'all, I Rick Sky here and I've completed my first day in the field with the DJI Mini 4 Pro and I will be back to the field to film a ton more. But I'm just going to show you the quick pack up and go. So the DJI's made it super convenient. Uh, this right here is the controller without the integrated screen. I didn't want to spend more and get the integrated screen controller. So you can see I took my iPhone. I used the iPhone uh, 15. Well, actually, let me just put it in there so you can see me taking it out. That would be more effective, wouldn't it? So I had the iPhone 15 Pro in there. And it uses USB-C, USB Charlie. So all you do... Now, if you use an iPhone that has a lightning, that came with that cord too. But I've got USB-C to USB-C. So I just unplug that from the iPhone. Notice my iPhone is in its case. And it still fits. So I take my iPhone out. Once I've taken my iPhone out, this is designed to conveniently wrap around and it's got a little hole where it plugs in. So that plugs in there. Now it's in, the, in that and this folds down. Then all I've got to do is unscrew the sticks. You don't have to, but unscrew the sticks from the controller. And I do that because these sticks, they, due to the nubby nature, there's little nubs on there they could scratch something that they came into contact with. So it just makes most sense to take them off, put them in the neat little storage area, and then this is flat and smooth. So if it rubs against, you know, say you're doing something professional, you got a suit or something on and rubs up against it, you won't, you won't scratch your suit up. So I've got that, that's the piece right there. And then the next piece is the, uh, and I'm gonna post a separate video simply demonstrating this, but after you've flown, you have, uh, you know, you'll have the uh, the drone. I mean, obviously, like this, it won't have it won't have the camera gimbal guard on, and all of the stuff will be will be out. So, I mean, the legs will be extended. So all you do, man, you just fold, fold, and fold, and fold, and then once you folded that, this piece. Like I've mentioned many times, old videos, DJI, don't make this transparent. This is semi-transparent. Make it a solid, non-transparent material, preferably a bright orange or a bright red so that if you throw it in the grass, I mean, look at that. That's in the grass. Are you going to notice that? You're in a hurry. You're trying to go somewhere. Probably not. But if that was bright orange or bright red, you might see it. Also, bright orange or bright red functions as a visual reminder to take it off before you fly because if you accidentally left this on before you took off you might think that that it's off because it's semi-transparent the camera can somewhat see through it so that's an opportunity for improvement why dji hasn't done that i don't know but i mean that's a small gripe not even a not even a technical issue now one thing that they also included and like i said I've, i just got the base basic controller drone so the, the least expensive one, it comes with this piece, which has a buckle. And this can buckle and, and keep your, better prevent your propellers from moving around while it's in transport. I've got to sit down with this because I took this off during my unboxing video. I've got to sit down and re-educate myself as to how to properly attach this. So I'll post a video for that. So I'm just going to leave it off for now. And this is another piece. They went with this dark gray color. I'm not irritated with it like I am the camera gimbal guard. Make this brightly colored too. But I can understand if I was a product manufacturer and I made things kind of a grayish, you know, tends to be camouflaged on concrete or grass or whatever. They're trying, I bet they're trying to, trying to hope people will lose them and, and then buy replacements. Not accusing DJI of wrongdoing, but what do y'all think? Comment below. But this has been an incredible experience. The pack up and go is super simple. Um, and I do have, if I want to care, I mean, I've got my little, uh, my little case, actually the case that I used for a previous drone and this will fit in there. So I can carry it around in that if I want to, but just to give you a quick visual, I mean, this is, this is it, man, except for my, except for my iPhone that's in my pocket. This is it. Super small, super lightweight, super convenient. This is the direction that DJI's needed to head for a long time. And since they've, since they released the first DJI Mini drone, this being DJI Mini 4 Pro, it's continued to get better and better and better. Better camera quality, 
better battery life, better overall, you know, the way it feels in your hands. I mean, it's awesome. So I like it. I just wanted to show you the pack up and go and that landing pad, I'll fold that up and throw it in my, throw it in my vehicle. But super good stuff. Subscribe, ring that bell and check out all of my DJI Mini 4 Pro videos. And as I always say, always practice and preach safe and responsible drone use. Because if you don't, this hobby may, may cease to exist. So be your own drone evangelist and always practice, not just practice, but preach also safe and responsible drone use. Thanks for your viewership and y'all have a good day. Hey y'all, Captain Irix Sky here. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to subscribe. It's youtube.com forward slash Irix Sky. And ring that bell icon when you do to be notified whenever I post another video. Thanks for your viewership and y'all have a good day.